Hello, welcome to Trisha's Cards and Crafts and another one of my product previews um, on a Monday. Right, this week um, we're going to look at the this stamp set, set of dies and these papers. These papers aren't the ones that I would have matched with them originally, but unfortunately when these first came out there were some really nice animal um, papers, but they've been, they, they're not available anymore. So this stamp set called the Rhino Ready, um, it's got some nice sentiments, um, some interesting um, rhinoceroses, um, and you've got grass, you've got a little um, like party blower and some birds. You're built tough, hello friend, you're stronger than you think, it's a great day and hope your birthday is wild. Um, these are great for anybody, but possibly more for a male, boys, men, I think, probably, for me. I mean, you could have women like them as well. I think they're fun, but uh, not everybody probably would, especially if you give them a rhinoceros and you're wishing them a happy birthday, they might think perhaps <laughs> that's what you think of them. <laughs> um, they're um, rubber um, stamps, so I've popped these already onto the backing, so they're um, ready to use. The die set, oops, I haven't used these yet, and I've had them a while, but I haven't had anybody that I wanted to use them as a card for, so, but I bought them because I thought of somebody and this, their birthday's coming up. So, this one, the stamp set's Rhino Ready dies, so these obviously go with the stamps, and here we go, we've got one each of the rhinoceros, rhinoceroses, to cut them out. You've got the grass, you've got, I think that's one of the birds, and I think you've got another one there as well. You've got a leaf, you've got the party popper, and you've got a party hat. And then you've got these, which are the trees, or you could use them as grass perhaps, or something in the in the distance so some mountains some scenery um so you've got another leaf there and another one so you've got other things as well in this in the die set that you haven't got in your stamp set so these look for really effective i've seen some fantastic um cards with these and hopefully we'll be making at least one um design with these uh using the dies as well but the first one we'll do is a simple stamping one so those are all the dies. So and there's the stamp set. So these are the these are the papers, and this is one side, and that's the other side of that one. It's quite sort of bumpy looking. And it's really nice and textured, and that's quite nice as well. So then you've got this one, which is a bit like a sort of metal plate, but in um, moody more. And then you've got that on the other side. Then you've got this one, which is again a very textured um, look to it. And you've got this gorgeous pretty peacock background. Sorry if the sun is getting in the way. <laughs> then you've got this lovely textured um, background that you could use. And then you've got this on the back. Again, a, another textured um they're all very textured. <laughs> I think that's why they're called what they are. And then you've got this one. And I think this one would be nice to make, to put some of the uh, rhinoceros in front of them. So I have it as a background to a card. And you've also, I mean, you could make quite a lot out of that. And then on the back, oh, I love the back of that. That one has got, and I like that. So it's sort of a mottled effect up there, but you've got a nice, um, again, pretty peacock but it's sort of graduated as well. I like that very much. That's right, both sides of that one. This one I'm not so sure about. <laughs> it just sort of looks like sort of paint drips with, I don't know, like cinnamon stuck to it. Maybe, hmm, I don't know. But I do quite like the other side. This side is quite nice. And I could put it that way around or that way around, or even have them coming down. So you've got something you could either have them going up, look as if they dropping or all that way around I don't know what do you think 
you can let me know. <laughs> yeah, so these are called, the papers are called Earth and Elegance. So not there's no, no texture in it. I thought there was. Um, and the colours that are used, Copper Clay, Grey Granite, Misty, Misty Moonlight, Moody Mauve, Pebbled Path, Pecan Pie and Pretty Peacock. So those are all the papers that I'll be using. Well, not all of them, but I'll be using some of these papers as well this week. Okay, right. So if you've got any ideas, you can always send me some. If you've made anything with any with this set or if you've um, made anything using those papers, you could always um, pop me a message or send me um, a picture of them. And it would be really nice to see it. So there you go. Those are the sets that I'm going to be working with this week. Thanks for joining me and I'll see you soon.